Hello, trivia lovers, and welcome to my channel. I'm your host, Mr. Quizter. Today, the topic is mixed knowledge. You'll have 10 questions and four multiple choice options for each. Don't miss the bonus question right after question number 10. Here we go. Question number one. Which of the following numbers is closest to the number of muscles in the average adult human body? Is it 350, 650, 1250, or 1650? The answer is 650. Question two. As of 2001, what is the minimum number of points required to win a game of table tennis? Is it 11, 16, 21, or 31? The answer is 11. Question three. An unidentified and mysterious item, like the briefcase in Pulp Fiction, is known in the movies as what? Is it non sequitur? MacGuffin, Distractor, or Hijinks? The answer is MacGuffin. Question 4. According to the 1818 Mary Shelley novel, in which country was Victor Frankenstein born? Is it Russia, Poland, Germany, or Italy? The answer is Italy. Question number five. Our sun, one solar mass, is approximately how many times the mass of planet Earth? Is it 333,000, 3 million, 33 million, or 3 billion? The answer is 333,000. Question 6. The word halcyon means calm, peaceful, and joyful, but it is also associated with which of the following birds? Is it hummingbird, owl, kingfisher, or eagle? The answer is kingfisher. Number 7. At just under 14,700 feet, the Matterhorn will be found within which mountain range? Is it Andes, Pyrenees, Carpathians, or Alps? The answer is Alps. Question 8. Which influential rock group was formed in North London by Ray and Dave Davies in 1963? Is it Jethro Tull? The Kinks, Yes, or King Crimson? The answer is The Kinks. Question 9. Nicknamed The Walrus, in which sport did Craig Stadler excel, most notably in the 1970s and 1980s? Is it football, golf, swimming, or cricket? The answer is golf. Here comes question number 10, followed by your bonus question. If you've enjoyed this quiz and you'd like to support the channel, it only takes one second to leave a like. And make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any future videos. Question number 10. If you are a zymologist, which of the following would best describe your field of study and work? Is it gene splicing, sandcastle building, kite flying or winemaking? The answer is winemaking. And here is your bonus question. I'll leave the answer in the description for you to check. Before you go, let me know your score in the comments and click on one of these for your next quiz. What is the country whose flag you see which displays a trident head and was unveiled in 1966?